Welp, my tent stayed in place and I didn't get wet. That's a start to a good day. Man, the storm was intense last night. Pretty cool though. We were looking for a scenic shore and we found this hidden gem. Guess what guys? I had a huge breakthrough. A success story, actually. I have no idea where Urban Jasmine went. Um, I'm trying my best. It says it's 0.5 miles to the actual falls itself, but you get to actually run into water on the way there. But I'm not stopping. I just want to get to it and then relax. My body was being pulled down by a 20 pound bag on my back. So going up through, oh no, very um, a little bit of a uh, hill. The people look at me and say, it gets worse, but it's so worth it. Not looking forward to the, uh, I guess the hike of it all, but I'm waiting for the hype of it all. Yeah, that wasn't funny, I know. I had sweat dripping from my hairline to my toes. It was insane. But guess what guys, I didn't take one break. The hill only got worse, but the view was so worth it. Unfortunately, I had a big POTS episode and I couldn't take photos or video of this amazing waterfall. I'm not feeling well. I don't know if I'm going to make it to the car. I couldn't get any footage. Not one. I got two photos because I just feel so... so hot. I mean, so much climbing to get here. And I have so many stairs to go up. And the backpack is so heavy. And I'm so disappointed because I can't even lift any of my cameras. I'm using the GoPro. I'm so disappointed right now. It's all downhill after this. All downhill. If I don't fall myself. After a 30 minute episode, I slowly made my way back to the car. I wanted more, but my body was done. Heading back to camp, we saw this amazing waterfall that we had to stop at. The sunset was on fire, almost literally. Well, not literally, but man was it beautiful. Time we got back, I was almost sleeping standing up. I slept to yet another thunderstorm. Good night, guys.